Welcome back to The Breakdown. Today we're taking a look at Anchor's new rapid charging wireless charger with a stand. It's also got a digital display and a 10,000 milliamp battery pack, which is a lot bigger than most of these MagSafe chargers for newer iPhones. We're gonna break down the pros and cons of this, let you know what you need to know about it and more. First though, quick disclaimer, this was not a review unit. I did buy it myself to give you a review here. All these opinions are my own. Second, pricing on this changes so rapidly, I hate to give you a price and have it be wrong. I'll put a link to it in the first pinned comment and the show notes down below if you want to find it on Amazon. If I don't have to answer one of your questions, leave me a comment. I'll do my best to answer them in the comments. And lastly, before we get into it, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up. It really does help because it lets YouTube know you enjoy what we do here. All right, let's dive into it. Starting off with the MagSafe charger itself, pretty standard, a little flat MagSafe connector here. Put your back of your phone on it. It does have a nice stand here. You can pop this out to either stand it this way or vertically to charge your phone and maybe use it for videos as you go uh, playing. It also has a little display here. You press this button here and I'm not sure if that's really going to come up. There we go. And it displays how much battery power is left in it along with other information. Now this button here is not an on and off for the battery pack. Just connecting this to your phone will start the charging. It just turns this display on and off. You see it's already off. Prevents the display from draining the battery by running all the time. And then lastly, there is a USB-C here. Now this USB-C can be used for charging of devices. You can connect it, something to it to charge there or you can charge this battery pack through this USB-C here. Let's take a look at everything that came with this. I'm gonna talk about a few key things that you need to know about. Starting off with, this is a 10,000 milliamp battery pack. You should expect one to two charges based on that, uh, depending on your phone. And that's from zero to 100% charges. I think most phones nowadays will be closer to one. Some smaller, older phones, which probably don't have MagSafe chargers, will get you closer to two. Uh, now with this, even though it's a more rapid charge through MagSafe, it's still only a 15 watt charge, significantly slower than doing it directly through a USB-C. It does have faster charging than the standard wireless charging, which is even slower, but that's something to keep in mind if you need rapid power now. Now the nice thing about this is you can just slap it on the back of your phone. It's got a good, powerful connection. It stays on the phone in our testing. We had no problems keeping it connected or it falling off. So that is a nice thing. Great thing about this, you take it, if you have a compatible phone, you don't have to worry about chart or bringing a USB-C cable or USB cable, depending on your type of phone, which one, what you need to charge your phone. Overall though, I'm gonna give this two thumbs up. It is a very nice battery pack. It's a little bit thicker than a lot of the others because the battery pack's a lot bigger. And this allows you to get a full charge from zero to 100% on most phones with it. So I'm gonna say this is a great battery pack that if you are looking for something like it. Now, a few final notes here. Again, wireless charging is always slower than wired. Keep that in mind. USB-C in the side does is how you recharge this. And overall, in our testing, we had no problems with any of it. Now, I will give this two thumbs up and put a link to it in, face, um, in the first pinned comment on Amazon and in the show notes. If I didn't happen to answer any questions, leave me a comment, let me know. I'd love to hear from you. But I'll be honest, this is a very simple, straightforward battery pack. You recharge it by plugging it into a wall charger through the USB-C. You connect it to your phone either through the USB-C cable or through the MagSafe charging um, on the back of your newer iPhones, and you're off without any problems or really a lot of work to it. So overall, two thumbs up. We'll be back again with another video just like this one real soon. Thank you to everybody for your support. You can check out the hundreds of reviews just like this one on our YouTube channel. Take care, be safe. We'll be back again real soon.